Hello. My name is Shallow, and this is Siren. The, uh, version 0 0.8 update of, uh, the episode 1 demo, anyway. Uh, Siren is a total conversion mod for Doom that's been in progress for a little while now. I played it, oh, I want to say two years ago. The version of it that was out then. Uh, it's very good. It, uh, you won't find it on, on this channel. I didn't record it. Um, but I'm excited to see the new stuff that's in here. Um, let me just get started on normal. It's got a very cool, like, Doom 3 kind of feel to it. Oh, this is... This is all new. Uh, eyes open, operative. As of 72 hours ago, the facility did not exist. We need a full situation report before the circus gets a hold of this. Uh, satellite jamming? It's the only possibility, but way more advanced than we've seen before. This might be another New Mexico black site on our hands. What's the ETA on Stinger? Stinger Division are stationed on Phobos. It's a 26-hour flight down the surface. Until then, you are on your own. Acknowledged. As ever, you may benefit from gaining some trust in there. This is represented by the icon on the lower right of your HUD. I have minus 50 trust. That's not... Great. <laughs> I assume? I don't know. What is an average quantity of trust? I can be nice. Initial intelligence from Noculus Division has been sent to your PDA. Make sure you have the keybind set up. The default is P. Ah, uh, great. I didn't pack a book. One more thing. From here on in, you will be referred to as Welter. You're heading hundreds of meters beneath the surface of Mars, Welter. Expect the unexpected. Welter? What kind of a name is Welter? Siren. You couldn't give me a cool code name? I couldn't be, uh... I couldn't be Eagle or... Big Dick? I don't know. Um... So that did say P is by default set up. Something weird happens with the uh, keybinds in this mod. I had to go in and manually set them all up. Like mouse one was not bound. Let me make sure. Okay, it is now. Because I went in and fixed it before I started the recording. Uh, the first time I tried to record this, mouse one was not bound to fire for some reason. <laughs> so just be careful when you, uh, if you install this yourself, when you install this yourself, because you absolutely should. Um, the keybinds do seem to be a bit wonky by default. Okay. Um, yeah, this I'm familiar with. I'm fairly certain the original demo I played just started you off here immediately. It didn't have that whole intro cutscene. Oop. Neat. But I'm going to do this first. Excuse me? Titanium hammer points, all right. Currency of some kind. Um, let me do the climbing tutorial here. Yeah, oh. Oh, I should turn my little crosshair off because this mod comes with its own. Hang on a minute. Okay, there we go. Crosshair's off and I fixed the sector lighting. I had it brighter because of something else I was playing earlier. Um, I need to update to the new GZ Doom. I think they have streamlined the sector brightness options I was reading, which might be good for me because those options always confuse me. Here we go. Subsurface silicon. <laughs> Never mind. Um, yeah, I remember this having a really cool Doom 3, like, Dead Space look to it. I think it used to actually use... Oh, shit. 
Okay, well. We're dealing with zombies. That's, uh, that's that mystery solved. <laughs> I remember there being a lot more downtime before enemies showed up. Uh, but yeah, this, I think, used to use the Doom 3 for Doom 2 texture pack. And it seems to use... Well, that door, I think, is still from Doom 3. But a lot of this, I think, is custom now. Level 3 credentials required. Don't have that yet. Oh? Hello. That's a huge bitch! That used to be a Cyber Demon sprite in there. In old versions. That's way cooler now that it's its own thing. <laughs> Okay, the power's on. We're just gonna leave this guy in that tank there. Rifle rounds. I don't have a rifle yet. <laughs> yeah, I've woken up some kind of enemy in that room. I can't get to him yet, but I can hear him. Howdy, fellas. Um, how much ammo do I have total? I don't know. I do have two incendiary grenades. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> Gross. Uh, that might have been a bit of a waste, but... That's okay. I'm sure there will be more grenades. Stab. This, uh... This mod has a lot in common with... Lit Doom, or Live Through Doom. I wonder if uh, some of the people involved worked on both mods. That mod, if you don't know, it's kind of like a hideous destructor light, or a, uh, it's a, it's a weapon pack that turns Doom into a sort of survival horror experience. Okay, so there's still some Doom 3 in here. These are Doom 3 textures for sure. The Black Smoke. All right. Yeah, we got Doom 3 style lore in the PDA. Good stuff. The black smoke is killing everyone. We're all switching to vaping. This is a this is a UAC vaping ad now. <laughs> no wonder they called it Siren. If you hear it, fucking run. We managed to reset it for a short while using the override switches. It's only a matter of time before it's lurking again. If you hear the smoke? What sound does smoke make? Uh, using your Nash soft PDAs. Okay, full end, of, end encryption. Should you need to delete an entry, you can long press to remove it. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, no, that all seems pretty self explanatory. Job opportunity. This is a reconnaissance opportunity to detail a site that, as of 72 hours ago, did not exist. Oh, this is a summary of my mission. Okay. Let's see if there's a little more information here than we got earlier. There's been a complete blackout from the surface of Mars since the failed Operation Red Lab in the 60s. Out of nowhere, a hive of communications appear on all channels. Thermal imaging from the in-proximity ISS reveal a sprawling complex under the Mythos Ocean itself under the southern polar ice cap. Origins are unknown. Intel from Noculus documents that Union Aerospace Corporation applied for mining and construction rights on Mars after the war. The Global Space Initiative rejected this proposal and the application was buried. Those with first-hand experience with the corporation were suspicious at the absence of appeal. 
but no party had the resources to investigate, let alone police, any activity. If the UAC are involved, you will need to expect an unethical and hostile environment. It's a requirement that you enter this mission armed. Heat signatures suggest high numbers of personnel down there. It's unclear how many will be hostile. The true size, layout, or infrastructure cannot be determined, nor do we have any method of knowing the current status of the crew or viability of life support. Your objective is to determine the status of life-sustaining infrastructure and an initial assessment of crew status. Write and send a full report for Stinger before they breach. Identify the operational purpose of this facility. Recover any information pertaining to the company. Immediate compensation can be provided upon receipt via upload link. This job is valued at a rate of 2.5 times your usual fee. Make contact via the usual channels when it's done. All right, cool. Great. Yeah, that works for me. Holy shit, what the hell? Gross. <laughs> Nasty. I didn't notice that before. They got weird little tongues. Okay, well, it's good to... It's good to be in the hands of somebody who knows their shit. These, uh, my employers seem to be well aware that the UAC is always up to shenanigans of some kind. Uh, I know I can continue up that way, but there is a door here somewhere that I can open. Right? Maybe? Maybe not. I think I'm thinking of this door, which I can't open yet. I need to come back with a key. This is the uh, the dangers of playing something you've played a long time ago already. <laughs> I have like half memories of parts of this. Graphene weave, quick fix nano putty. Is this how I heal? Oh, sweet. We got, like, Doom 3 terminals. <laughs> Whoever's computer this was has Steam on there. Graphene Weave, a nanorobotic expanding putty from Ron Seal. Each nanite can seek out damage to clothing and armor, replicate the sampled material, and intelligently bond itself to its host. Using it will repair any armor or helmets that you are currently wearing. Neat. Okay. Man, yeah, this is a lot like Lit Doom. That my armor has durability that I'm going to have to watch out for. Wonder how much that'll cost me. I have 60 of them. So I'm guessing it's pretty expensive if they're throwing that much of it at me already. Oop. Game's auto-saving. Good. You'll love to see that. Oop! Oh, you're so cool. Look at you. I mean, it's not cool that they're experimenting with demons, but look at these sprites. They're uh, they're Doom 64 imps, but they've got a lot of edits to them. That's like the, the Doom 4 pre-release faces on them. I love stuff like that. <laughs> I love that Doom's been around 30 years, that there's 30 years worth of obscure references you can throw together into your mod. Okay, so it's not just zombies we're dealing with. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Get behind cover. Hey, uh, why am I so tiny? <laughs> why am I just a little guy? <laughs> there we go. 
that's better. Kind of. I mean, there's still some in there. Oh, I wonder if those lines are brand new? I know Doom 3 in the beta, the zombies had taunts and stuff. Look at the <laughs> this guy that I blew up with the grenade. It's just a boot with a bone sticking out of it. That's great. Oh, I wonder if I lose the magazine if I reload. Uh, not sure. Med kits are carried and can be used at any point. Okay. Uh, this is telling me that I've rebound that. The those are the default keys, so it's not it's not responding to the way I have my setup, but that's okay. Uh, where is my health anyway? Eighty-eight. Is that my health or is that my armor? It might be my health. I'm not sure. With the knife equipped, there are a few movesets available to take down enemies quickly. Try holding fire or quickly pressing fire, then alt fire. Thanks, Ash. Must be the AI. Whoops. Uh. Whoops again. Sorry, Ash. Oh, do you just dispense random? Help? Okay. So when you say hold fire, you don't mean fire. You mean the quick knife button. Oh, or do you mean this? This is what you mean if I actually equip the knife rather than using the quick melee button. Okay, yeah, I can block. Oh, I remember the my CQC training. All right. <laughs> that a spent? That's a spent shell. Yeah, I can't pick those up. Okay. Not sure I wanted to open that just yet. So were these guys possessed the way they are in regular Doom, or are they just UAC security? Oh, shit. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I think I just released all the... Uh, all the prisoners. Oh. oh, they're fast, too. <laughs> okay, so they're still locked up. I just opened that door. Let's see what's over here first. Cool. Found some uppers. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't do drugs on the job, kids. Must be a locker room of some kind, I guess. Oh, these open, too. Oh, nice. Okay. Great. Can I... Ooh, I can climb in the vent. Shotgun. Gordon Freeman over here. Shoot it. Shoot it when it charges at you. It will stop it for long enough. Don't let it sneak up behind you. Um, okay. Oh, shit. There better not be something behind me as soon as I close this. <laughs> Uh, 
No. Okay. Uh, does that go into my PDA? No. Okay. That's just a one-time thing, I guess. How am I supposed to not let something sneak up behind me? I mean, by definition, if it's sneaking up behind me, I'm not going to know it's there. There's not a lot I can do about that. Um, let's reload the shotgun, I guess. Uh, this will be a good time to find out if I lose the ammo when I reload. No, I don't think I do. Cool. It always annoys me in games that do that. It, it doesn't bother me as a, as a rule. I think you can design your game like that, that's fine. It, it bugs me when the magazine falls on the floor and suddenly you can't pick it up again. If you're going to have your guns drop ammo when you do a tactical reload, I want to be able to go back and pick up that half magazine I dropped. Ooh. Is there a... No. I was playing something else earlier that had a lean mechanic. This does not... Ew. All right. This is a bad idea. I should just leave that guy alone. Let's check out the old, uh... Oh no, what is happening in there? <laughs> This is what conservative thinks will happen if you if you allow gender neutral restrooms. Oh. There's nothing. Also, I'm a ghost. Why am I a That's very weird. <laughs> it's weird to give the player a, a sprite. But make it that. I, okay. Actually, hang on. Um, yeah, okay. It's not just a mirror thing. That really is what the player sprite looks like. Cool. This is madness. As my half of the deal, I left the cash you posted to me in my locker. The code is 1818. Use it to pay a smuggler to get you out of here before you become like me. Well, that's not the normal kind of restroom graffiti I'm familiar with, but, all right. Wait. <laughs> where's your, where's your toilet paper? The place where the toilet paper is supposed to be. There's just a little, a little shelf with three seashells on it. Pick up the little urinal puck. Fair enough. Um. Can I turn the TV on? Read any of the books? No. Can I break this glass? <laughs> let's uh, let's nominate ourselves for a Darwin Award. So I can't break the glass, but he can hit me through it. And I can't hit him. So that's... Let me just use this med kit I have. <laughs> Playboy. Someone reading the classics. There's a chainsaw in there. The old Doom 3 beaver tooth. CV-11? What are you doing in here? 
Ingredient availability desolate. <laughs> Current quality poor. Fallen Comrade Burger. Morgue Sausage of the Day. Larva Soup Corn Syrup. VR Filet Mignon to drink. Is, is that OOS or is that DOS? Okay. Little details like that make me think of Duke Nukem. Just goofy stuff for no reason. Greetings, human. How may I be of service? Greetings, cuboid. Can you tell me what happened here? Yeah, let's interrogate the vending machine. Hey, I've seen nothing. I'm just paid to keep my mouth shut and serve soda. Well, can I get a soda? No. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> okay. I wonder if the UAC stuff will eventually be replaced with Skilla, or however you pronounce that, this company. Or if they do intend to keep this somehow in, uh, in the Doom setting. Ooh. I don't know, maybe that's an unrelated corporation that does other other things. Yeah, you can't break the glass either. Oh shit. That's the black smoke, isn't it? Oh, that's spooky. Okay, so that's the sound black smoke makes. All right. Question asked and answered. I feel like I'm leaving a lot of stuff behind. This level is huge. Level five credentials. Man. This place is awesome. I love those zombie sprites, too. But, uh... Oh, this is where the smoke is. Let me leave that alone. Can I shoot through that? I think I can. Yeah! Those appear to be the uh, Doom 64 Marine sprites. Ooh. There we go. Oh, oh shit. Okay, yep, nope, go that way. That's fine. Okay, that, that black smoke is just going around killing everything. It's coming back. I don't have a way out. Uh, oh. Oh, I'm cornered. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, uh oh. That's all my ammo. Ooh. That shotgun is very slow. Um. Oh, there's a burger here. Can I eat that? Ooh, I can. Oh, 
<laughs> I don't think I have the ammo to deal with those guys up there. Uh, ammo's not really the problem, it's cover. Yeah, thought so. Oh. Uh. I got my hands full with the twins? Is... what? I don't... <laughs> huh? Okay, that's a reference to something I don't think I understand. <laughs> Did, uh... Okay. <laughs> and that's the kind of bathroom graffiti I'm used to. Possibly crude. Definitely confusing. Alright. No. No, you stay closed, you wet egg. Oh, damn it. There you go. Now you've done it. What is that creature from? That looks great. <laughs> that is such a good sprite. All the sprite work in this is excellent. The original stuff and the stuff based on uh, existing sprites, it's all really well done. And it's all cohesive, which I like. The, uh... You know, the Doom 64 stuff fits together with the rest of it. Great, because it's all been... Like, redrawn. Oh, I'm gonna die again here. I need a, a rifle or something. Shotgun and pistol is not cutting it for this encounter. If I never go into that room where the smoke monster is, maybe I never activate it. Maybe it leaves me alone. Ow! Okay. okay. I will have to deal with these guys, though. <laughs> no survivors. No survivors. There we go. Man, I am not doing so hot. You really can't give me a soda, huh? Alright. Time to die again. Oh, you know what? You shoot faster if you... If you scope in like that. If you hip fire it, it's pretty slow. That's pretty cool. That makes sense, I guess, if you're if you're hip firing, you're not handling the recoil all that well, but if you're shouldering the the shotgun, you're gonna handle that a lot better. That makes sense. Kitchen's closed. Hmm. Some bergs. Can I get the fries? Ooh, I can get the fries. How about the drink? Whoops. <laughs> I'll have a number nine. A number nine large. Two number 45s. Why can't I get that one? Okay. No beer, no drinking on the job. I'll take uppers, but no beer. Whoop! Oh. 
You know what a lot of these sprites remind me of is, uh, excuse me, what was that? Something just opened. Oh, it's that up there. It's the, uh, it's that sector above sector wonkiness that Doom has sometimes. Nice. Um, there we go. Um, let's use the small one too, yeah. Uh, these sprites remind me a little bit of Supplice. Just the way they're, uh, maybe it's the way they're shaded? Maybe it's just the fact that they're all very cohesive. They all work together really well. Um, and this is a lot like Doom 3. Um, okay, that bathroom note, it was 1818, right? Maybe this one? Do I just have to try them all? Okay, how about this one? Hey, there we go. Ooh. Thank you. I'm sorry you weren't able to use those credits to get out of here in time. But, uh... I will use them to buy myself a shiny new gun. And you're probably wandering around here as a zombie, so I will shoot you with it. <laughs> it's the circle of life. Um, PDA. Blue hoodies. There's a growing circle that are jealous of the select few that are getting special vocational days. Even came back with matching brand new blue hoodies. What are they? Prefects? They're gone for days. Where are they going? And what are they doing? I'd love a bit of excitement in my routine. Terry O'Shea. Thanks, man. Um, that sounds like a cult. <laughs> Maybe. Probably. We'll find out, I suppose. Oh, how do I get chainsaw? I want chainsaw. Ooh! Right. Forgot I hadn't been down that hallway yet on this save. Ooh! Oh, that water is crisp. Did I get health for that? Maybe. Wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I love that Duke Nukem. 3D changed the game so much that anytime anything is interactable in a game, my first thought is, oh, hey, it's like Duke Nukem 3D. <laughs> Except when Duke Nukem Forever did it, that just made me want to die. <laughs> All right, I think I've got to go this way. Security fence. Siren disabled. Is that good? I think that's good. God, I love the sound effects. Someone the other day pointed out the, uh, Oh, there you are. Is it gonna stay in that room? I think it is. 
uh, someone the other day was pointing out that the Doom 3 plasma gun has the most satisfying sound effect when it reloads. And it really does. I don't know what it is about that thing. Mmm, this reminds me of it. It's so good. It's... It's... Nice and... How would you describe it? Tactile? It, it's got a very clicky sort of... I don't know. It... it, it, it tingles the same part of my brain as, like, during a, a, a floppy disk drive. <laughs> or those old, like, 32 gigabyte iPods with the, uh, with the internal disk drives. Mm. Oh, the way those things whir and click is so good. <laughs> Love it. Chainsaw? Maybe? Can I, can I climb this? I can't quite jump up high enough. Oh. Oh, wait. I can climb up this grate. That's cool. <laughs> Is this where somebody hid all the chainsaws they accidentally ordered? What is that? Rhenium nanites. Sure. I love Doom 3's explanation that somebody was supposed to be ordering rock saws because there was a, a, an archaeological dig site in Doom 3. Someone made a mistake and accidentally ordered chainsaws. And now they have a whole bunch of chainsaws they can't use. That was hilarious. I love that. <laughs> it always has been a bit weird that there's a chainsaw in Doom. It makes no goddamn sense, except that in the 90s it was cool to kill zombies with a chainsaw. And it still is. I mean, I'm not saying they were wrong. Oh! Do I have any healing? I have a bandage. Let's use it. I have some flares. And a proximity mine. Siren disable okay, I don't I don't know what disabling the sirens does. I'm a little lost on that. Um, let's use this graphene weave. I want to see if... Um, I can't use it. Maybe my armor isn't broken enough yet. Any more bad guys in here? I think they're all dead. There's definitely something behind that door. But as long as it stays behind that door, it can do all the creepy shit it wants. I don't care. Uh, we'll check that in a moment. Here's the exit. Hey guys. Still trying to leave. Oh, actually, probably, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, here comes the black smoke. Hey, black smoke monster. Oh, you J.J. Abrams ass bitch. Yeah, go kill the zombies. Leave me alone. Oh! Oh! Oh, it's fast. Uh. Oh. Do I just run from it? Oh, 
Oh, it didn't even kill all these zombies, like I was hoping. Ooh, I can't shoot it. That doesn't work. What does this do? Oh, not helpful. <laughs> Thanks, game. Good advice. Wait, okay, yeah, I get it. I didn't want to assume, but that's totally a Icarus reference. Because <laughs> you got these, these paintings of Zeus, and there's one of Icarus at the end here. Um, he, uh... I believe he had twins a couple years ago, so this must be a reference to his kids. Neat. <laughs> that makes sense. I don't, I don't think he worked on this, but he must have, uh... I mean, he's covered so many Doom mods, I'm sure he gave Siren a, a shout out here or there. I know for a fact he's playing it... right now. Because <laughs> that's why I'm playing it. Um... I mean, I was going to play Siren this month anyway, but then I saw he was doing it and I had to move it up on my schedule. <laughs> I already had to do that for Trenchfoot. Doom needs more horror mods. <laughs> I wrote out a whole schedule for October for the mods I was going to play and when I was going to play them. Oh, it's been hard sticking to that schedule because every time I, uh, somebody I follow uploads a video, I'm like, oh shit, I was going to do that one next week. I guess I have to do it now. <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe I'm overthinking, overthinking this kind of stuff, but I don't know. I feel like if I upload a, a video around the same time as somebody else also does it, it, it doesn't seem quite as shitty as doing it a week later. Hmm. Oh, I think I get it. Okay. These, these terminals disable the siren. But only temporarily, right? Let me see if I can sit here and wait for it to turn off again. And then does it does it become active again? At some point. It does. Okay. So now it must be wandering around. But I can come find one of these terminals again and disable it again. I think that's how this works. So I have some limited... ability to... fight back against it. Fight back might be... a strong word for what... I'm doing when I disable it, but, you know. So if it's chasing me, I can come here and that. Great. Level four credentials, all right. I can go in there. Uh, there's nothing for me that way, so let me just ignore that. Let's go this way. Ooh. Hitting some lag. That means scripts for sure. Or a lot of enemies spawning. Ouch. Oh no. Oh, I'm so dead. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. 
Oh, I can hear the siren coming too. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's be a little more careful around here this time. Oh, so much for that. Ooh. Oh, them being able to climb around on the ceilings is, uh, pretty brutal. Hello, what is this? Who's there? Are you one of them? <laughs> I don't know if I'm here to help. I'm here to find out what's going on. Who are you? You first. How did you get here? Who sent you? Uh, lie. I'm here to eliminate any threats. Lie. I'm an investigator from the GSI. We picked up your signal. Who am I talking to? My only options are to lie. Hmm. What is the... GSI? Uh, something in my PDA told me, I'm sure. I just don't remember what it is. I'm here to eliminate threats. No, because he's immediately going to be... Who am I talking to? Just you. Me and my team of mercenaries. Um... Let's tell him just me. Want him to trust me. I'm one of a few that are still alive. You can call me Miller. Man, all our code names suck today, huh? We've lost control of the situation here. Civil unrest. Studies on species we don't understand. In our attempt to pull the plug, Sector Union turned on us and overthrew the facility. Sector Union? The UAC try to claim they are an official division of the corporation, but there's word that they are a mercenary outfit. There's nothing concrete on their origins. Their practices have been unpleasant. What exactly is the situation here? It was doomed from the start. We're walking in two worlds down here, and we belong in neither. In order to compete with those things, our population became addicted to Blackroot. One by one, they became sick before they became something else. The hell is Blackroot? You're really not from around here, are you? Blackroot has us all in its grasp. It's bad news. Before another time. <laughs> okay. Let's get to it. Where are you held up? Get to the sector below this and I'll contact you again. You'll need to find the keys to access the elevator in the middle of the foyer hall. There's three of them in total. There will be backups hidden around here somewhere. Um, is there anything else you could tell me? Yeah, look up. These things love to hang on the ceiling. <laughs> Roger that. Wait, I need to start over. Uh, what exactly did you lose control of? Um, okay. Okay, what are these things? They are subjects to be studied for our survival, but that's not my field. This is their world, and they're pissed that we're here. Well, I'm here to extract survivors. Get to the sector below this? Okay. Stay put, I'm on my way. It's gotta be one of the blue hoodie guys, right? Totally not a cult. Oh, I need to be more careful. Those things really are everywhere. Bandages, nice. I love these little medical beds. These are so cool. Need to find another one of those siren terminals. Before that thing comes for me again. Uh, zombies wandering all over that place outside now. That's not good. Cool. Oh, I wasn't wearing any armor before. Now I have armor. Cool. Alright, that's how that works. 
Hold still. <laughs> Just shooting your ankles. Just gonna grab those. Might have been stupid to waste that ammo, but uh, we'll see, I guess. That uh, seems to have done something. Let's head back and find out. Smoke monster. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's fine. I'll just sit in here. <laughs> Regenerate my health. Reload my guns. Ah, I'm remembering now in earlier versions of Siren, the uh, smoke monster was a. Uh, just an invincible revenant that ran after you and punched you to death. <laughs> Having it be its own thing is is nice. Uh oh. Didn't mean to do that. Oh god, I might, <laughs> I might load a save and redo this. This is going very poorly for me. There it is. Okay, okay. All right. Should be disabled now. Okay, so when it's disabled, it's just sort of stuck on the floor? Blue key card, nice. It's level 3 biometrics. Lock it down. Okay, so I can get into level three doors now, which is nice. Um, let me just sit here and reload or, or recharge my health real quick, and I will, I will catch up with you in a minute. Okay, so level three. Three, I think, was all the way back where I started. Is this open? No. Oh no. Oh, the reaction time on these guys is just nutty. Yes, survival horror is very much not my thing, as I'm sure you can tell. Uh-oh. Well, this guy's gone. That's not a good thing. Is this level three? It is. Finally gonna deal with the guys in here that I woke up way at the start. Where is he? Well, he's in here somewhere. Uh, 
I can hear him. Is he up the stairs? Probably. Oh! Alright, this is gonna be a... Uh, there we go. Not as bad as I thought it would be. That looks like a new gun to me. <sighs> the Ripley Pulse Rifle. <laughs> Ooh, look at the magnification on the on the scope. Oh, that's so cool. I've never seen that in a Doom Wad before. How'd you do that? That's so cool. Questionable syringe. Oh no. the uh okay that's how it works like a like a gun <laughs> I think I might have just missed when I tried to shoot him earlier oh. good thing I got all these bandages huh what's the questionable syringe I'm gonna not use that Oh, well, that was terrifying. Glad I turned around there when I did. Ooh. Yeah, so if the alien inspiration was not clear enough already. Can I not shoot through that? I can shoot over it. The uh, Ripley pulse rifle does seem to make it kind of obvious. I gotta play that uh, alien TC again. Ooh! I'm sorry, I thought it was just imps down there. Where is he? Whoop. Ooh, that's very nice. Just zombies? Looks like it. Whoa, 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 whoa! What is that? Uh, it's like mini smoke monsters. Okay. Weird. And run past them, so that's good. That's all backpack full of ammo and credits. Cool. What is this? <laughs> There's like a section of the pool rooms just chilling in this facility. All right. I think we're going back in the vents. Uh, no, no, we're not. Ooh. The fuck is that? Let's fix up my armor. I'm just gonna use all of that graphene, huh? Yeah. Um. Oh, the bandage is ready to go. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's a strife robot. 
cool. Love a good robot. Am I even hitting him? I don't think I am. <laughs> um, hmm. That was the worst grenade throw ever of all time. Jeez, that guy has a lot of health. Getting desperate. I might try out this questionable syringe. <laughs> There's uh, someone on the Doom World forums has done a great edit of some of the Strife robots to remove the insignia and stuff that are specific to that game. I love those sprites, but. Yeah, I think they're right. The reason you don't see them a whole lot is because they're pretty specific to to that game. So good on the creators of Siren for just using them anyway. Oh, two for one. Nice. But I do wonder if they'll replace them with the more generic varieties now that those exist. So I've got grenades now. Not the incendiary kind, but just regular old grenades. Gross. Oh, that is a lot of those things. Oh, they're like head crabs. <laughs> Gross. Ah. Stuff like that is such a... Like, this is such a good sprite. I have to assume it was created just for this mod, because... If this was just freely available and out there, I... I have to believe other people would have used it by now. I would be seeing that sprite everywhere. Whoa, that's what that syringe does? Okay, awesome. <laughs> oh, that's what the flare is. Do I hear the siren? Is it coming? Oh! <laughs> I was just enjoying watching those uh, guys fight the demons. I'm sure he's fine. Hello? Well, there goes all my shotgun ammo. Is that? Oh. Crushers of some kind. Or 
mining equipment, perhaps. Some kind of industrial stuff. Cool. Good. And this map is huge. Shut up. Ooh. Ah. Okay, I think I'm getting better at this. <laughs> Good. I was worried that guy was going to instantly prove me wrong. <laughs> Am I back in the lab now? Sort of. Ooh. I do hear the siren humming away. These controls just for the doors? Yeah. Wait. Uh oh. Okay. That's weird. You use the door itself to open the door, but the controls to close the door? Um. Hello? Uh. Are you okay? We're on. Who's there? Oh. One of you. Are you okay there? The black smoke is down here. Fucked me up. You need to trap in here using those doors at the end of the room. Then we can blow it to high hell. If I run into it, I'll ask it to come this way. Let's get you out of here. You need some attention. I, I am not... <laughs> I don't think this guy's making it out of here, man. I, I think he's... He's done. Hey, if I run into it, I'll ask it to come this way. Yeah, you do that. She responds to please, mommy. Get out of here, asshole. <laughs> In my defense, I did not have a response to that. That wasn't being an asshole. Both of those responses were asshole. <laughs> uh, what's going on here? I need to know what we are up against. <laughs> you're as clueless as the rest of us. Whoever you're with, they've stitched you up good and proper. What do you mean? Just get the smoke locked in here, and fuck off and let me die. Have a great day. That will heal in no time at all. Man, I am an asshole. <laughs> Okay. Where is it? Are we just gonna blow this place up? Is that why we're locking it up next to this big flammable tank? Oh, here it comes. gonna come straight in here please mummy oh there it is yep 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 right this way right this way run door closed door closed now what now I leave Oh shit. Damn it. You 
couldn't have waited for me to get up the elevator before blowing the place up. Oh. All right. Something tells me it's not dead. Hmm, I don't like the sound of that. Nothing this way. All right. Well, I guess we're going toward the very not good sound then. Oh, just zombies. Okay. Bandages. Nice. Oh, of course. Hell stuff. God damn it, UAC. I'm held up in the middle of it. Tell Zero Body what took us five years, all four of you, nine years next week. Mail me your love. Uh, yep. Yeah, okay, that's zero five four nine. I suppose that's one way to encode a message. Medkit. Oh, I'm all full on medkits. All right. Didn't know there was a maximum amount I could carry. It's in here. Oh. Oh, I got that just in time. Oh my god. All right, it's the other side of this room. Uh, yeah, that's a grenade. Oh, I can't get under the door? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think it's back up. Okay, gonna have to be fast. Ooh. Oh, that didn't work. There we go. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Did I get access to another key in here? I don't know what that switch did. Oh, it did, yeah. Level four access, great. Uh, shit, what was that note? The code on the note. Hey, there we go. Oh, hey. Looks like someone dug a... Uh-oh. Someone's not doing so good. Hey, man. You in there. I'm here to get you out of here. It's too late. You, you'll you have to do it. Do what? Blow... Whoa! Blow the elevator shaft in the main hall. Oh, okay. The charges are already there by design. You just need to override the activation command. Isn't that our only way out of here? There are many ways out of here. <laughs> Okay, I'm convinced. How do I override the activation command? I might need that to get out of here. I'll pass on this one. When he says many ways out of here, I'm pretty sure he's not talking about like a secret exit. Maybe I'm dumb. Okay, I'm convinced. Take this hacking tool. It will work on most combination locks around here. It's single use, so don't waste it. You don't need to select it from your inventory. Approach the lock and a prompt will appear. Cut it. Do something else for me. My girls, Sun and Nari, they're still in the dorms. If I find them, I'll get them out of here. No promises though, man. No, tell them, tell them to take their pills. Then it will all be over. <laughs> Jesus, that's dark. Hey, what happened to you, man? 
The black root in my system is contaminated. It's only a matter of time before my body becomes something ungodly. How can I help? Let me end this my way. Um... I need my ammo, man. I'll come back when there's extraction available. Um... I said I'll come back. Uh-oh. I don't think I have that option. Do you have pistol? Thanks for the hacking tool. Do I... Oh, I still have my pistol. Ooh. Yep, yep, come here. Get away from the door. Damn, that thing is fast. Okay. Uh, well, I've got level four clearance now, so... What the fuck is that? Cool. We got, we got hellhounds. Nice. Oh, a bunch of wet eggs in here. Is that a new gun? No, just ammo. Oh, they're hatching. Confined space. Oh, good. It's locked. I don't have to go in there. Oh! Well, that could have gone better. Yikes. Give me your supplies. to the data uplink. Assign them responsibly, then destroy this node. 1331-2909. Okay. One. Whoops. 1331. One. Two. Nine. Oh. Nine. Good to know that in the future, uh, sticky notes are still causing all kinds of <laughs> data security issues. Uh, insert data sphere. Upload a G Lab data sphere for the future generations of Earth. I don't have anything to use with this. I guess I'll come back here later. What's this? Oh no. Did that just open up the confined space? Yeah, it did. Okay, I guess we're going in here after all. Okay, good. I'm not locked in. Damn. Okay. Probably still want to use the shotgun then. There's one more at least. Oh! Ah, <laughs> oh, the encounters with these guys all take place where there really is no good cover from them. What? 
that the Doom 64 mother demon? But like, <laughs> it totally is, yeah. But shrunk down and recolored. Neat. That's a cool demon design. I'm glad to see it get used more. Oh, can I get up there? No. Railing is in the way. I don't fully understand what those nanites do. Or the credits, for that matter. That stuff is just kind of piling up in my inventory. Uh, my mail. I'm expecting a delivery of proximity mines. I was given a delivery window between 10 a.m. and 11 p.m., and that was five days ago. Maybe it's in a drop-off locker in the canteen. I'm the one on the right. My code is 9992. I'd be grateful if you could bring them to my lab on five. For God's sake, walk slowly with them. Okay. I guess next time I head back to the... to the canteen, I'll have some uh, proximity mines to pick up. I read this? No? Just... Hmm. Status corrupt. Current quality Mountain Dew? Oh, it's the H2O monitor. <laughs> has the... Has the, the hell infestation turned... <laughs> turned the entire facility's water supply into Mountain Dew? That is a very weird... Very weird joke to put in here. <laughs> but okay. Does this go anywhere? I know I probably should be up there climbing along that pipe, but... Let's see if down here leads to anything. Well... Leads to that, at least. Oh, there's a thing over here. My mail. Okay, I already have that one. And there's a ladder to get back up. Oh, okay. It opened this. Nice. Armor. Excellent. Whoops. Can I shoot this again? I can, but I don't think it does anything the second time. All right. Hello, get on the ladder, please. There we go. Back in the vents. Man, this really is Half-Life. I see you hiding around the corner there. I see you. Oh! Man, that thing takes a lot of punishment. Down the hatch. anything okay 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 just gonna throw another grenade fuck it Let's 
got to be all of them, right? I think they're all dead. further down. What's in here? Oh. Dead imps. Cool. That heads down further still. Okay. Is there anything for me if I go this way? Or is this just going to be a waste of ammo? Oh, this goes up. Oh. Where am I now? Okay, before I explore this place, what happens if I go down over here? Not up, down. Ooh. Um... Oh, it just takes me back here. Okay. <laughs> well, never mind then. What about this way? Same thing. Okay, what is this place? Oh, I see you. It's hard to make these things out in the darkness. Oh. I think they might have slight homing projectiles. enemies could probably stand to be a little less tanky. Not everything needs to go down in one good hit like the imps and zombies, but uh, I don't know. Those guys seem to take a lot of a lot of damage before they finally go down. Hey, is that that sphere thingy? that I'm supposed to be collecting and putting in that terminal. Unforeseen consequences. The human body in its pure form cannot survive the various exposures here for sustained periods of time. The time required to complete our work. And yet, we came here to avoid being governed by perpetual states of crisis. Fear-mongering wouldn't work in a new utopia. It was easier to bypass the power of objection and distribute the MEBS via the water supply. There's no way we could have foreseen the MEBS reaction to exposure to foreign pathogens, which has consequently resulted in an unstable product. The MEBS program should be halted immediately and, in the meantime, don't drink the water. Oh no. They did the do. Just get me my third key. It looks like it. How do 
do I get in there? Maybe I jump into the top through those windows. Nope, can't jump on that. Okay. Whoop. No shotgun shells left. Almost no pistol ammo left. Man, I don't understand how the pistol works. It seems really inaccurate. Any more of these guys in here? Give me a shotgun ammo. Sweet gaming chair. <laughs> Definitely hear the siren in the distance somewhere. Why is this one green? Ah, that's why. Thank you. What is that? No idea. Another green computer. Is there a get out of the way chair. There we go. Interacting with that one doesn't do anything. But the other green one did. Okay. What about this one? This one's new and unique in its own way. All right, guess it's nothing. Cool, back here again. Let's go ahead and lock down the old siren. And I should be able to get some proximity mines here now. What was it? 9992? Yeah. Thank you. So let me heal up real quick and then we'll grab that key that's in that central room. is red key that's still offline um. so level 5 clearance is over here right there we go Those shotgun guys around here somewhere. I heard him. Gross. Why is there red goo on the floor? Lift? Ooh. 
there's a uh, there's a spicy Roomba on the ceiling over there. Ooh. I'm glad that turret shoots the the soldier guys too. There we go. Okay, prototype labs. Ooh, nice. All right, I can get in here from up here. Can I make that jump? Let's see. Yes! That's a secret, huh? How do I... Oh, man, I'm gonna have to remember how I get back to that terminal that asked for the, the sphere thing. Here we go, right? Upload data sphere. Ah, good old dial up. Data sent. Archiving complete. Snake, this is Iris Inoculus Division. That data stream has been intercepted and sent for extrapolation. We've scrubbed all traces of its origin, too. This will remain just between us. Snake? My mistake. Uh, so what is your handle on this one? Welter. Snake is way cooler. Welter, huh? To become deeply sunk, soaked, or involved. Does that description fit you, Welter? Not anymore. Oh, well that's a leading statement, Mr. Stoic. Want to expand on that? Which one of those adjectives sounds like fun, Iris? Yeah, Iris, I'm fun. Like a snake. <laughs> Interesting. Fascinating stuff. So Am I a am I a double agent? Am I secretly sending data about my mission to some third party? Is that what's happening here? Am I reading that right? Intriguing. Oh, I can... Yeah, I can do that. I might not want to, though. <laughs> that was probably a bad idea. <laughs> okay. Moving right along. Oh no, bunch of dead scientists. Oh. To tortured imps? Test subjects, I suppose. Hey, guy. Gonna come around the corner and shoot you. See? I told you I was gonna do it. Subjects 11 through 15. Extremely agile with flexible bones of a similar structure to human cartilage. Thick, semi-rigid skin that's impervious to heat and flames. The pores can secrete benzene that can be ignited by subsonic oscillations of thousands of tiny bones in the hand. Anatomy and musculoskeletal system is not dissimilar to that of our species. Atmosphere-dependent organs, blood. Despite several advantages, their bodies are just as vulnerable as ours. If they bleed, we can kill them. If it bleeds, we can kill it. You gotta put at least one predator reference in your 
alien inspired mod, right? All right, that one's working on some system updates, it looks like. Hmm. Oh, good. Can lock the siren down from here. What does this terminal do? Oh, it's not a terminal. That's where I got the medkit from. Right. Hmm. Did that do anything? Oh, it activated that uh, elevator in the middle. have the code for that. Okay, well, um, guess I'll have to go look for a code. There's a lot of supplies in there. I sure would like some of those. Oh, secrets 5 of 15, data spheres uploaded 1. Why are you giving me my stats now? Ah! Ah! What? What was that? Did I accidentally reach some point of no return? Do I just take damage when going in there? I guess so. Weird. Oh, wait, hold on. There it is. I can... I could use the hack tool to open this. But I only have one. I sort of feel like I should use it on the exit door, right? I'm gonna drop a quick save here and see what happens. Maybe I'll come back for all those supplies. We'll see. Oh shit. Well, it has gotten crowded in there. Um. That guy's not friendly. Ooh. Not at all. And that uh that big monster from the start, it looks like, is over there. No, it's just another strife robot. Killed it. Nice. Come on. Ah. Got him. <laughs> so is that this room all clear? I think so. Nope.
Oh man. <laughs> Having to aim with your guns in Doom is a, a reflex that I do not have. Yeah, I could hack this open. Hmm. Let's see what happens when I use the elevator. Active. Oh, I didn't want to go down just yet. Okay. Well, I don't think I have a choice anymore. Uh oh. Hmm. they fall on me from above? They did, yeah. <laughs> uh. So I wonder what happens if you just hack open the, uh, the exit door. Whoa. Okay, I thought this demo was a single map. I didn't realize there was more. Holy shit. I'm gonna, uh... I'll do this second map later. I didn't realize there was so much of this, but this is really cool. I'm having a lot of fun with this. <laughs> and the fact that this is only episode one so far is... Oh, just insane. I'll leave in the uh, link in the description where you can play this yourself if you want to check out uh, the rest of it right now. Uh, otherwise, I'll see you again next time where we'll keep playing Siren. Until then, you take it easy. See ya.